Earlier this year, China relaxed its population control measures, allowing families to have three children. But a city in the southwest has taken it one step further, becoming the first in the country to offer cash subsidies for parents who have more than one child. CGT's Nicole Ng has the story. This little girl is just two months old. She's special to her parents, of course, but she's also special in another way, as the first child to benefit from the first official cash incentive in China for families who have a second or third child. My little daughter was born on June 28th, just in time for this policy, and it just so happened that it was the first in Panjiuhua to register for the subsidy. <laughs> the city of Panjihua rolled out the measure just a month ago. Parents to get 500 yuan, around 77 US dollars a month, for each additional baby until they turn three. It mightn't sound like much, but Yang Jun says it's a start. Even though 500 yuan for her clothes and all her other expenses is not enough, but I think it's enough to cover her baby formula. She drinks A2, which costs around 250 yuan a can, and she'll drink about two a month, so that's 500. We traveled to Panjihua also to speak to government officials to ask them what's behind the decision to use cash subsidies and what they hope to achieve. Huang Zhiwen is part of the city's research team. He says, despite what it looks like, the measure isn't just about boosting the birth rate. We don't expect that because of the policy, every family will have three children. That's for each family to decide. But apart from childcare subsidies, we also help support elderly parents. So a full range of services from birth to old age. A wider welfare program, he says, aimed at attracting talent. Panjihua is an immigrant city. People come from all over the country. So we want to grow our human capital and bring in more talent. When that happens, that is the key to development. It's an ambitious plan that relies on supporting people to support those around them. Nicole Ng, CGTN.